Yeah, I want to say that I took this good and cheap carbon C60 for seven days, a full bottle, every single day. So it was um, 80 milligrams of 99.95% carbon C60 and 100 milliliters of olive oil every single day for seven days in a row. I also have been taking um, carbon C60 since um, mid-December of 2017, so now it's been about six months, it's mid-June of 2018. Um, I already took about six or seven, this is a, now I think it's close to eight, eight, eight liters of this stuff. Various brands, but mostly this brand. I started out with Purple Power, but I thought they were a bit pricey, although, you know, I have to admit the avocado oil taste with um, using carbon C60 is a lot better. And by the way, there's Feather the Cat under there, in case you're wondering where Mama Cat was. I don't know where BB Cat is, but Mama Cat's here, so. Um, the, I can't tell any difference, to tell you the truth. Now, I just want to tell you this, though. I make, typically, pretty much every day, I'll make um, espresso coffee. And when you make the espresso coffee, it actually, in the coffee machine, um, it makes four cups. You're supposed to take these real little tiny cups and you know, you're supposed to drink them and that's supposed to be four cups. I take the whole thing, the whole four cups that the espresso coffee machine makes. It's really like, it's less than eight ounces, but it's like powerful coffee, right? And I put it in this, one of these things, right? And um, I fill it up with ice and I drink it and I barely feel that. So I barely feel espresso coffee, okay? So, when I'm saying I didn't feel nothing from this stuff, I mean, you know, maybe it's just me, okay? I know there's a lot of people out there that felt way better. You know, combine that with the fact that I've been taking a lot of vitamin C for many years, like over 20,000 milligrams a day, and I did make sure I took the vitamin C at a different time of the day from when I was taking this in case it interferes with each other or something. I take a lot of vitamins and supplements and minerals. Um... I also use the Power Zapper every day, which is, um, you know, it's an electronic device that I think also is like an electron donor, not just a microbe destroyer. It's it, it'll boost your immune system cells and stuff. It's, I think it's an electron donor because of the positive offset square wave frequencies it puts out. I personally, I'm pretty sure that's what it it is. Besides just knocking out microbes, but. It, it's an electronic device, I, th I think, in my opinion, that is working like um, an electron donor, just like you know, baking soda would be, or vitamin C, or anything like that. I use that thing, I use that device 8 to 10 hours a day. So, you know, say somebody needed a lot of antioxidants, or somebody needed electron donorship or something to their cells, because their cells were weak. You know, the battery voltage on their cells was a quarter volt or something. They you know, needed to get it up to a half a volt and all this kind of garbage with electron donors. Donor, that's that's a lot of what antioxidants do. So if they took this stuff and it's like I think it's 150 times more powerful than vitamin C per milligram, right? Um, so if you got 80 milligrams of uh, carbon C60 in there, I think it's 167 or something times more powerful than vitamin C as an antioxidant. But say you know, 80, so it brings it up to um, you know, maybe 13,000 vitamin C. I don't know. And maybe it's more absorbable because it's in oil. Uh, you know, somebody was needed this stuff, they're going to notice a difference. I, maybe that's why I didn't notice the difference because I probably take a lot of anti I do take a lot of antioxidants and healthy micro micro uh, what do you call those micronutrients and stuff right I already take that stuff so when I took a lot of this I didn't notice anything okay now thing is do I feel bad from the beginning no do I feel bad now no I feel fine and I felt fine before so maybe that's why I didn't freaking notice nothing and again. I don't even notice when I take a whole pile of freaking espresso coffee. So, you know, what the hell can I tell you? But, you know, I'm glad I did this experiment. And then in the future, I'm going to do is about one bottle of this stuff a week. 
So basically less than, maybe not quite a half a, half a um, liter of carbon C60 a month. I think that's plenty. You know, you can get overboard with this stuff. It's like, uh, but you know, sometimes it's like consistency, um, just sticking with it. And you never know. I mean, you know, five years from now, maybe I'm going to be feeling great. Maybe, maybe so many, maybe 10 years from now when I'm in my 70s, I'm going to be feeling great. And I'm going to be thinking, oh, that stuff really didn't do nothing, but I feel fine. And maybe it's because I've been taking this stuff. Maybe 10 years from now, I'm going to be in really fine shape. Now, one thing I did pick up on is that when I smashed my thumb, <laughs> actually, I didn't hammer this. I did, I think I caught it in something or something and smashed this. This wasn't healing up good. And when I put the carbon C60 on it, it healed up like really good. And a couple other issues I had, I actually smashed a toe one time and I did some other stuff. One walk. Now, that's why we're steel tip show shoes now. I put the carbon C60 on it. It worked where the coconut oil didn't work, when the DMSO with aloe vera didn't work. The carbon C60 worked with the olive oil. That worked to heal, and it healed this thing up really good. So, I don't know. You know, that's what gave, that, that gave me the idea. Why not try a whole bunch of this internally? Because this stuff seems to work topically. You can see it worked topically better than other stuff you apply topically so that's what gave me the idea of taking a lot of this internally I personally do not feel any different but then again I didn't I don't feel bad anyway okay I feel pretty strong I got good energy I'm gonna be out here mowing the lawn in the sweltering heat <laughs> with no wind and uh, I don't you know I'm in my 60s I feel fine right I was out here putting some parts on my intake manifold on my El Camino waiting for the rest of the parts and I was up here late last night in the wee hours with this kitten of this feather cat down here the mama cat is now back I don't see the kitten but I figure maybe the kitten's okay that's just a side note um, this video is going to probably be around for years and you probably wonder what the hell am I talking about this kitten for but the kitten was out here last night and I was like you know, you know I didn't even know this cat had a kitten until about a week ago <laughs> the first time a kitten came near me was the other day. Now, last night, this cat, that cat was gone, and the kitten was here. And I was like, what the hell happened? Well, I don't know. I ain't going to worry about it, because I think they, they're all, they got it all figured out. But uh, I don't know where the kitten is, but it's probably okay. But, you know, you might not feel anything with this stuff. But that doesn't mean it's not working. And, like I said, I think the people that really feel like you know, hey, I feel really great. I got all this energy, and I'm going to be doing cartwheels now. Maybe that's because they were kind of messed up in the first place. Maybe they were, you know, like in other words, me taking away over 20,000 uh, milligrams of vitamin C every day for the last few years, taking like a lot of different different vitamins and minerals and stuff, and not smoking, not drinking. Um, even like I'm doing the fasting now, the intermittent fasting, uh, not serious fasting, but it's like uh, 17 hours of fasting with seven hours of, you know, where you eat food, but mainly pretty much only a meal and a half a day. And a lot of that is sometimes it's uh, the, the vegetable packages called superfoods. So, I mean, you know, you know, if you're already doing all this stuff, I mean, and if you add this, you're not going to notice it that much. But if you are pretty much a mess in the first place, and you add this, you're probably going to notice something. I just, I just didn't notice nothing. But then again, you know, I guess the real test would be if I went to the gym. And I haven't been to the gym in a while because I hate the music they play in there. Um, they... Um, you know, if I just went to the gym and I was able to do some workout and it was a little more than I usually do and um, and that's after not being there for a while, then I'm going to believe this stuff probably did something. But I think it is working. So, like I said, I'm not trying to knock it. I'm just saying that if you really are very healthy or pretty damn healthy in the first place, you might not notice nothing with this stuff. But, you know, it's like 
a lot of people, well, let me put it to this way. If you hear like, you know, if you get a person that's like 22 years old, they're doing all these bad things to their body, right? They're drinking a lot, smoking a lot. They don't look old because they're 22. But, you know, you take that same person, you say you had an identical twin, one was being a health nut and the other one was doing all the bad stuff, you're going to notice a difference by the time they're 40, right? And that's, it's like it takes a long time before you really notice a difference. And it may be where this stuff is working is what not going to happen to you is where the difference is. You know? So, not everybody that takes this stuff is going to say, I feel like really great, but I'm not knocking it. I think this product is good. I'm still going to continue to get it. I got an order on hand. I got 10 bottles gone away. I still got a couple bottles left. And, uh, you know, it's like a mixed bag. I mean, um, again, I guess if you're really kind of messed up in the first place and you feel lousy and you don't have any energy, you know, you feel sluggish and you can't sleep at night and you know, whatever. And then you take this stuff and you feel a lot better. That's probably because, you know, it's clearing out a lot of the bad toxins and, and you know, knocking out oxidative stress and all this garbage. In my case, I probably knocked out all the toxins a long time ago. I probably knocked out the oxidative stress a long time ago. So when I'm adding this, it's I can't perceive anything. But then again, I don't think it was a waste of money to do that because um, I think a lot of this stuff that I took, I mean, some of it goes out of your body, but then not all of it goes out of your body. It could be doing subtle things that I don't realize. And, you know, if it, it turns out that maybe some months from now, I feel better than I ever did in my entire life. I'm going to start attributing it to this stuff. But, you know, I could tell you that when I use the Parazapper many hours a day, uh, that alone even makes me feel a lot stronger. That alone. And I was able to confirm that with the body tester from the, the Thunderbolt device, the body tester that measures your body voltage and stuff. You do this test. And I actually had excellent body power for body voltage. And that was before I was even doing this stuff at all. So, I mean, you know, that might be another test. I mean, maybe, you know, if you order the device, uh, the Thunderbolt body tester, and, you know, you do a, a test, and then you take this stuff, and your body, you know, your body uh, energy, or whatever you want to call it, your body power goes be better, well, maybe that proves it. But then, like I said, my I was already, you know, I noticed that the... I think there's a lot of ways to get to the same freaking goal. You know, you could do it with nutrition. You could do it with vitamin C. Um, you could do it with uh, baking soda, sodium bicarbonate, or potassium bicarbonate would even be better. That's an electron donor. Um, you could take baths with baking soda. That can, that that helps. Um, you can use this stuff. <laughs> you know, I think this stuff actually stays in your body longer. Um, the carbon C60. You can use electronic devices like the Parazapper. Probably, you know, probably the Thunderbolt probably does the same thing too. I noticed before I even tested the Thunderbolt, um, the Parazapper gave me excellent body body energy. I think that's you know, there's a lot. I think there's a lot of ways you can get to the same goal, and that's why I didn't feel nothing because <laughs> I'm already there. You know what I mean? I'm fine. There's nothing wrong with me, and so anyway. And uh, if I see the little kitten out here with her, I'll tell you about it. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> this one's got kids, too. What are you doing, man? Another female. She's freaking cats all over the place. And I and you know what? These cats just came over here with their kittens already, so I don't know where the hell they came from. It's like, it wasn't like there was some cat out here that I could have had fixed. They already had their kittens. This one I can't even get near. So, when her kitten gets better, bigger... I want to get her fixed feather down there, the little one. Anyway, over now.